Okay, a little bit better. Hi, good morning. I hope you are having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, night, whatever, whenever you are seeing this. For this week's YouTube video, I thought I would train like Nutty Foodie Fitness. She's one of my personal, or like more so favorite influencers when it comes to fitness because I just love her whole mindset, motivation, not motivation, mindset and advice when it comes to just like motivation, discipline, getting things done, all that jazz. And because and I also just really enjoy her right now because she is training for a triathlon, a full Ironman. In fact, she just did her um a one of a half Ironman as training and she knocked it out of the park. So yeah, well, I thought today I would train like Nutty Foodie Fitness for this YouTube video, as I said before. Uh, let's see. T this morning, I did one of her run workouts that I found. I have saved because I do use her workouts from time to time when I don't have any. Like, interval bikes, runs, all that. And swim. So, yeah. Let's see. This run workout was, I believe, I'd have to check. I think it was 10 minutes hard. And then the rest, just easy jog to 30 minutes. So that's what I did. And I'll put the stats for that run right here. Or somewhere in the video. So, yeah. And then later today, uh, in a little bit, once I kind of just knock out all my work, chores, and all that, I will do a swim workout. I'm still awkward about filming me swimming, so I'll just insert some footage when the time comes. So yeah, as of right now, I'm gonna go get ready for the day and then talk to you guys in a little bit. Alrighty, hello. I am now more put together, so. Hi. Yeah, I'm more put together now so I can talk a little bit more. So yeah, we are training like Nutty Foodie Fitness today and did the run workout. Then I did my usual little routine of core and light stretching. And then later on today, I have a swim to do. I got to total up the distances from the workout she had in one of her videos. So yeah, I'll put the distance here. And so, yeah. Uh, let's talk a little bit more. As I said before, I love her for her mentality and mindset behind everything. Like, if you just put your mind to something hard enough, you can do that thing, whatever you want. And I lo just love how she's now more into really challenging herself. And it's awesome to see. Like, I well, even before she was really into it, the stuff she did was incredible. Like, running a marathon without any real training behind it. And then doing an ultra marathon for a challenge. And now a Iron Man. And she's even said, like, in Q&As on Instagram, that she has plans for even more challenges in the future. <clears throat> so, yeah, I just think what, what she does is incredible. And, yeah, that also just helps make me want to do more and challenge myself because I have a couple plans after my half Ironman in the future that I want to do down the line. And, yeah, I just love her mindset behind fitness. Plus, I, she, I just love how bubbly and smiley she is. And I've messaged her before in the past, and we've had small little conversations. So yeah, I just enjoy her overall. She is probably one of my favorite fitness influencers out there that I follow. So yeah, that's kind of why I want to train like her for today. And I'll catch you guys before I do my swim. So as of right now, I'm just going to do my usual little routine of get checking everything, editing, filming, uploading, all that. Chores, everything. So I'll catch you guys once I prep for the swim.
Okay, hello, hi, I, it's been a bit. I hope you've enjoyed the montage, V-roll, whatever you wanna call it. I did the swim a little while ago, and yeah. I've just been going through all my work stuff, Instagram, all that jazz. And I, yeah, I'll put the stats right here, and that's, pretty much it for today. I think I'm just gonna vlog a little bit of my day just to kind of keep the video going and all that. So, well, let me think. What am I gonna do right now? I'm probably just gonna read and then in a little bit I will eat lunch and then I'll just take you through a little bit more if anything interesting happens. So yeah, swim was fun, easy, quick. I could tell I am probably getting swim gains very off frequently now. Like I can tell it's getting easier, I'm getting faster, I'm holding uh, reps longer, and I'm not having to take as much breaks. So yay to swim gains. But yeah, as of right now, I'm just gonna read until lunch. So I'll show you my lunch, even though if you know me, you know. First off, I deeply apologized yesterday. I, one, nothing really interesting happened, but two, I also forgot that I was filming. <laughs> so yeah, but I did take pictures as you saw and put a little voiceover or whatever of what I did. I forgot to take pictures of my dinner <laughs> and yeah. My dinner was just a salad, as per usual. You always have to make sure you have a salad every day, in my opinion. And a smoothie bowl, apple pie or whatever smoothie bowl that I made the other day. With just yogurt, granola butter, and, a, and yeah. And then for dessert, I had some ice cream and fruit, as you guys saw. But yeah, I apologize for forgetting that I do YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, but overall, I'm just gonna also recap the day. I love the training. As I've said before, I've done some of Nutty Foodie Fitness's workouts before and thoroughly enjoyed them. And yeah, it was a great day. Fun, easy for me, everything. And yeah, I think her coach, Andrew, who sh gives her the workouts is incredible. I love how he pushes her because he knows her potential as an athlete. I think he's an excellent coach. Like, I, yeah. Overall, I think he's an excellent coach and is doing very well with her, and I'm glad to see that she enjoys him and that she also enjoys these workouts. And I'm glad that I do too, and I wasn't miserable. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, then be sure to give the video a thumbs up, share it to all your friends, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all in the next week. I hope you have an amazing day. Bye!